Вот, посмотри, Ждал это Олди. Хорошо. out of the bank. This time we're gonna nail him with the goods. Come 
We couldn't arrest him over there even if we caught him. Jackson County. The Reno's run it from top to bottom. Well, we got one of them anyway. Yeah. Let's head back. Is that going to help? Is that going to bring Bill back to life? Take it easy, sis. How? Not knowing when you go out that door if you're ever coming back. This time it was Bill. And the next time somebody else. That's the way it is. It doesn't have to be. You could leave the state. You could go somewhere where nobody ever heard of the Renos. Where would that be? Anywhere. It was my fault. I just felt it. I smell it. Ain't no use going on about it now. The important thing is how did they know we'd come? Yeah, how did they know? And so far ahead. Maybe somebody recognized you last week when you were sizing up the job. Maybe. But how did they know when we was coming? That our dear brother? Yes. Yeah. So it's finally happened. Arino got killed. Plant, we want no preaching. Please be The baby of the family dying in the streets and his big brave brothers running away. Not even animals would do a thing like that. Dead in the street. Not dying. As if that made any difference. That's enough of that kind of talk, We sent for you, Clint, because we want you to go to North Vernon and get Bill's body. Tell what you got. You mean they won't arrest me? The Reno that's honest, that's quite a distinction in this community, an honest Reno. We rode into an ambush. Somebody told them we were. That shouldn't surprise you. The Renos are worth a lot of money. Dead. You knowed we was gone. You yeah, accused me of being a spy. I'll tell you. That. Wouldn't put it past you. Really you really bothered bothered the sound singer. He was right fond of you, Clint. So, so was I. I tried hard, I tried hard enough to keep him from pitching in with you. And you. you as long as you Пока live, don't you ever accuse me of being, being, being an informer again. You got you plans? Keep them to yourself. I don't want to know about them, not even accidentally. You won't. You're notorious outlaws. The law will get you sooner or later, and they'll get you any way they can. In the bank, ambush, while you're sleeping, they'll get you. Bill's death was only the beginning. And you see that, Laurie? Can't you see it? You're harboring What do you expect me to do? Paul would never have left you the house if he'd known how you were going to use it. I can't turn my own brothers out. How far does loyalty go? They're not only destroying themselves, they're destroying you too. Leave her alone, Clint! Peterson won't leave her alone! Don't you ever let her get to you. He won't leave any of you alone. We can handle anything that Peterson throws our way. Like you did today? All right. 
I'll go to North Vernon and get Bill. We'll bury him beside Ma and Pa. Perhaps their souls will be a little less troubled now. Да, когда-нибудь мы получим это право. Не думаю, что Билл сказал бы так же. И хотел как лучше. But they're gonna go sooner. Come Saturday, we're going back to North Vernon and blast the devil out of them. We'll get even for Bill. And this time, we'll get the money. We'll get the money this time. Куда он направился? Он на встречу с человеком Может, он уже дома? I'm 
Yeah, that's off. Spy? What are you talking about, Sim? You're Peterson, man. You're Peterson, man. Peterson, man. You're crazy. Don't lie to us. Murphy. You know me, boys. You've known me for a long time. Yeah. We yeah. also know that you told Peterson, Peterson to the bank about the robbery of Bank of North Vernon. Why would I do that? Because you paid for it. You just delivered a letter saying that we're going to head north and then again. Isn't that right, Murphy? I don't know where you got such an idea. We paid him. We tested it, Murphy. Sim broke in with a piano and talked about it. We know that it's for sure. And Cartwright saw you write the letter. Cartwright's lying. Get a rope. You kill me, Frank. Somebody else will come. We'll handle him too. Мужики его стоило. Джон, Джон, увидел его. Мы оставим сообщение, чтобы знали, что случилось. Нет времени. Послание Питерсону. Клэкстон, отец. Хорошо, пусть войдет. Заходи, Монг. Рад видеть тебя, Монг. Садись. Как поездка в Денвер? Читали о Мерфи? Такое происходит, когда что-то идет не так. Рина хитрые и жестоки. Они контролируют почти всю Индиану. Судья, прокурор, шериф. Все на их стороне. Рина сделали им выборы. I still wonder how a thing like that could happen. Well, people who've had freedom as long as we have sometimes take for granted. But when they come to the election day, they're lazy. Or jealous. Same thing. Our job is to get it done. 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 I didn't know exactly what you had in mind, but to bring me all the way from Denver, the way I figure it, this is sort of a promotion. Don't let your vanity get in the way. You better judge it, Monk. I'm a working man, Bill, with a job to do. If I didn't like my work, I'd have gotten out of it long ago. In the war, we called it calculated risk. Yeah, it's just like that. I've got a new man I want you to work with, Monk. I want you to work with, Monk. I want you to work with, Monk. I don't figure this is the time to break in a greenhorn. All new to us. As far as I know, he's had some experience on this line. He's had some experience on this line. Maybe not experienced with this kind of violence, but I think he's the kind of man that can handle himself in the cold. His name is James Barlow. Barlow. I see you remember. It's the same James Barlow I'm thinking of. I do remember him. He is. He was in the employment of the United States, which we found out after the war. Mr. Greeley says he was worth a lot. 
Мистер Линкольн решил привлечь его. Мистер Линкольн согласился. Жены некоторых джентльменов находят его очень обаятельным. Подавляющего большинства отец. Напомню одно приглашение. Да, однажды меня пригласили на званный обед. Министру Стентону. Он тоже был там. Скажу больше. Человек, который одурачил Стентона и меня, одурачит и парня Ирина. Можешь ему полностью доверять. Дай ему разыграть спектакль. Итак, он сделает так, что они сами выйдут на него. Дайте ему мои приветы. Рост 6 футов 3 дюйм, вес 195 дюймов, глаза карие, волосы русы. 6 футов 3 дюйма, 195 дюймов, глаза карие, волосы русы. Мы будем стрелять, когда поезд Доброе утро. Мы приехали со стариком Нелом. Мне нужно копченое мясо, 10 фунтов сахара, 5 фунтов кофе, бекон, сода и краски. Хорошо, мистер. Доброе утро. Доброе утро. У Джим Барло, но не у Нелла. Правильно. Вы ждали в ближайшее время. Остановитесь на ферме? Ага. Вы художник? Да, я. А что вы рисуете? Ну что, вещи, людей, как Эль Греко, Рембрандт, Ван Дейк. Не совсем так. Это мистер Клэксон. Как вы делаете? Вы тоже художник? Нет, я просто смотрю на мистера Барлоу. Он не полностью выкрыт из войны. Доброе утро, мистер Лора. Доброе утро, мистер Фишер. Мой заказ готов? Да, сейчас принесу. Очень приятно, мисс Рина. Он художник. Это все, сэр? Извините, пожалуйста. Три доллара и двадцать центов. Ну, 
Mr. Fisher, can you change this? Mr. Barlow, have you got anything smaller? Sorry, I have. Mm. Take all my change. Hey, what was our Thank you very much. Приходите come еще. again. I'll Конечно, do that. I'll be around for some time. There you are, Miss Laura. May I help? Oh, don't bother. Quite the contrary. Sure. Что ж, Thank спасибо. You. Thank you very much. Hope to see you again, Miss Laura. May I call on you sometime? Boy, I'm afraid not, Mr. Barlow. Who are you, Mr. That's none of your business, Pete. Better be on your way, you. Oh, I beg your pardon? You heard so. On your way. My friends, you have very good manners. Sorry, Miss Laura. Miss Laura. It's still up to your old tricks, huh? Thirty thousand dollars, Frank. That's a heap of money. Are you out of your mind? I told you we didn't do this train robbery. The robber wore a mask, had hazel eyes and sandy hair. It was around 35 years old, 6 feet 3 inches, weighed 195 pounds. The description fits you, John. Careful, Lattimore. It's a lot of other people, too. $30,000. Judge, you'd be mighty pleased to share a heap of money like that. We didn't do it. But I wish we had. Don't argue with him, sir. You're in no position to get up at him. Listen, you've got your full portion of every job we've ever pulled. We'll go right on getting it. So don't come around here accusing us of holding out of him. All right, Frank. But as prosecuting attorney of this county, I warn you! Don't come around here accusing me of holding out of him. Don't come around here accusing me of holding out of him. Don't come around here accusing me of holding out of him. It would be rougher not to execute us anymore. Sit around doing nothing while we take all the chances. Well, Ace is in the hole. You've got to pay for Ace in the hole. $30,000 is a heap of money. How would have thought of holding up a trade? Seems like a business worth concern. What's the matter with them? Oh, money crazy as usual. They're accusing John of holding up the train. Yeah, but Frank shut him up. Do you think it's smart to make them mad? They better worry about making me mad. Fine, Oz. You set it up well. Good. Buy some extra shoes, man. No, it's not a young lady. Two gentlemen and men. It's not to be a couple of fellas named Lee and Pete. They're a part of the Reno gang. The family? No, just a man. Well, you certainly started by rolling, all right. You sure did. That's the object. But the description does fit John Reno. Думаю, они этого не делали. Они не работали в одиночку. Фрэнк не работает 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 в одиночку. 
Нам не следует торопиться. Мы должны что-то предпринять. Наши доходы сильнее и сильнее, скоро полностью прекратятся. Ну что, скоро кончится планета, на которой нас выбрали. Нам не светит второй срок. Надо подумать, что будет браться еще на два года. Наши дебюшки справятся не видно, для кого не секрет. Организованная афера. Мне не нравится это слово, но это так. Мы должны быть реалистами. Как все организовать, как все проконтролировать? Сколько мы там возьмем? Около 20 тысяч долларов. Привлечем к этому делу Джейсон и Харфайда. Это не имеет значения. Когда дело касается денег, должен быть кто-то, кому я доверяю. Вы еще кому-то можете доверять? Это записка из банка. Появилась на него сограждана в обоих. Серийный номер, как у найденных на месте ограбления. Из магазина Фишка. Надо узнать, кто это. Конечно, я помню. Я не видел с этого ограбления, я считал с племянник Иола, который напал на Питера Маккартни. Да, его зовут Барло. Художник, ну что? Кроме того, это хороший повод You may think you're spiting me, but let me tell you something. If anything goes wrong, you've got just as much to lose as the rest of us. Get that through your pretty little head.
I hear mice. What's going on here? You two. Who are you? The law. Anybody else inside that house, come out with your hands up. I'll shoot this county for every dime it's got. Mind telling us what the charge is? Suspicion. Or worse. Suspicion of what? Train robbery. Train robbery? Why, you're a bigger fool than I thought. All right, boys, take them into town. Well, you can't do this, I tell you. Most disgraceful thing I ever heard of. Who do you fellas think you are, anyway? The law, that's all. Take them in. Six новых, кстати, мы купил. Может, пока нет сыки, поделим их между собой. Почему? Почему? Почему бы и нет? Посмотрим в доме. We were coming to see more from Robinson, Illinois. We saw the crowd around the money box. We went down there. There had been a train robbery. We found the money. I guess the robbers dropped it. For three hours, I've been telling you that. If for three hours, I've been telling you we don't believe it. I can't help it. Sit down. I have a drink of water. No. The money matches. The description matches. Your arrival here matches. Everything matches. Where's the money? You took it. I mean the rest of it. The other $29,000. Oh, what's the use? You won't believe me. Any news? You won't talk. How about him? Nothing. All right, on your feet. Come on. Come on. Where's the money? Я здесь. Go Начинай, ahead. говори. Ты слышал, что я сказал? Я здесь генеральный прокурор. Это мое дело. Он знает, что я как прокурор должен проверить его показания. Итак, что ты хотел сказать? Можно воды сыграть? Конечно. Как вам эта ситуация, судья? Что именно? Случайность. Небольшое происшествие, которое имело место, вызвало такие последствия, хотя ничего могло не быть. Все было тщательно продумано. Я встретился с информатором в железнодорожном офисе. Он сказал, когда будут перевозить деньги. В хороший момент управление отходит. Все их деньгами был вскрыт. И до этого момента все шло идеально. А потом... Потом начались случайности. Обронил несколько структур при подъеде. Расплатился деньгами с такими же серийниками. Я прокололся. Где деньги? Спрятал. Мою долю. Твою долю. И действовал бы в одиночку. Никто не сделает такой арест. У нас было шесть. Семь, включая информатора. Где они теперь? Разбежались? Трое здесь. Двое. Клэкстон и я. Я он не при делах. Ничего не знает об этом. Доля Клэкстона тоже здесь? Вместе с моей на ферме Иова. Где на ферме? Вы не сможете найти, я должен пойти туда с вами.
Вы практичный человек, Сиджи. Конечно, sure, you вы можете отправить кое-что present, меня в тюрьму, но вы могли бы хорошо заработать, используя more. нас в таких делах. Me, Спросите, как? У моего информатора есть сведения о поездах в большие суммы Можно заработать до миллиона долларов. Говорите, что есть информатор в международном офисе. Большая ошибка, суперинтендант. Какой офис? Я тоже практически человек, судья. Я не знаю, а как бы я узнал о поезде? И как бы я мог узнать, что на нем будут деньги? Дело на миллион долларов. Только не со мной в тюрьме. Если не мы, то это сделает кто-то другой. То, что ты мне рассказал, выглядит очень убедительно. Все, что мне надо, это немного свободы. Это будет не так просто сделать. Многие люди в городе знают, что ваш мальчик, многие знают, что у вас нашли деньги с поезда. Вам достаточно сказать, что я нашел их около денежного сейфа, и это сделал кто-то другой. Какие мне гарантии, что ты не надуешь нас? Лучшие в мире. Вы мне нужны больше, чем я вам. Здесь удобное место, чтобы скрываться между операциями. Кроме того, как я уже говорил, у вас есть стимул в размере 3000 долларов. Джентльмены, полагаю, что он чистка слеза. Подождите, может вы не поняли меня? Мистер Барлоу не имеет ничего общего с ограблением поезда. Он нашел их деньги. Да, он чистка слеза. Пусть Картрайт освободит тех молитв. Я провожу вас на ферму Эйр, мистер Барлоу. Пойдемте вдвоем, а я... Нет необходимости. Oh, да, way, кстати, uh, вы вдвоем сохранили долю с тех 500 долларов, которые забрали у меня. Это только начало. Хорошо, пока все хорошо. Что делать дальше? Мы должны дождаться новостей из главного офиса. Нам долго и ждать. Надеюсь, не очень долго. Я сообщу, когда они будут. Хорошего дня, джентльмены. Если я посмотрю, то не надо. Вы получите, если вы будете просить, вы получите. Просто скажите. Вам надо дать ему еще люди. Он будет хорошим Дэвис Кэнди с Рино. Это лучше, чем Джейсон или Картрайт. Может быть. Одно дело, он не страшный, да? Вы полагаете, что он справится? Он должен, значит, получить тоже на арест. Что-нибудь еще без лора? Oh, yes, I'd like the side of bacon. But yesterday, I know. I'd like another side of bacon. Хорошо, сейчас. Eight and a half pounds, all right? Fine. Anything else? That's all. Here's that article you asked for. Oh, thank you. 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 Мистер Сколько 
Shall we shop tomorrow? A couple more shopping days like this, and I can open my own store. It's been a genuine pleasure, Miss Laura. I agree. Thank you, Mr. Farrow. Good night. Killed? Contrary, I was just planning my future. I don't like you, Barlow. I don't like you at all, but I admire guts. Judge Hawkins is also pretty good at train riding. Fair, I'd say. Seems to think you're good enough to ride with the Reno. That's a compliment. My partner and I will consider your invitation. No partner. The judge didn't say nothing about nobody, just you. I see. Uh, where do we go? Now, now? Yes. Uh, when? When you ride with us, Barlow, don't ask no questions. Come on. We just crossed. Right. Right. Any harm now in telling me where we're going? Up ahead. How much farther? You ask too many questions. What do you mean by that? Look, you're along as an extra hand. You got nothing to say. Did the judge make it clear? Yeah. All right, now I'm making it clear. So get it through your head. All right. Put up, circle around, and go in. Nobody? Yeah. You meet us on Church Hill. Pick John and Sim up in front of the surveyor's office. Come on, John. No Frank's the courthouse is no good the front way. They gotta go around the back. Frank didn't plan it that way. Frank didn't plan to have the sheriff eat his dinner across the street either. We gotta use the back door of the courthouse. All right, let's go.
всем слушать его. Ты, подними руки. Вон туда. Мне кажется, что это 2122 доллара. Это не так много. Могло быть больше. Почему не взяли больше? Все, что нормально, пока он не выстрелил в одного из них. Ты что, не думаю. Но рисковать головой на 2000 шаблон за сумму доллара. Лучше уж вернуться к плугу. Не считай моего долга. Мне пора в кровать. В этот раз я понял, что никогда не слышно. Но в следующий он будет с нами. Спокойной ночи. Полный дипец. Слишком бердый. И у меня все прошло удачно. Очень удачно. Вы рисуете замечательные картины, мистер Барлоу. Извините, что я разочаровал вас, Лора, но, как вы знаете, в нашем бизнесе такая помощь просто необходима. Вы не лучше, чем другие. Более того, вы не так хорошо. Я ваш отец, но не верьте меня. 
I can't wait any longer. I gotta get a message to Peterson. Why don't you wait till morning, Bob? He'll turn up. Maybe so, no, maybe not. He might have been sidetracked from his business. You know, I was warned about his fondness for women. You better get a horse set. As you say. That's funny. Good evening, gents. Hi. Go on, I want you to get a lot of started on this way to Peterson. I'll saddle up right away. Where have you been, Jim? What happened? Several interesting things. Huh? Several interesting things. Let her go, Dad. Good. Hmm, he's making progress. Wants me to meet him at the sheriff's office in North Vernon as quickly as possible. No. Get word to our field man that I'll be there Friday night. You best make it Saturday night. It may take a little while to find Hieronymus. He's always on the move, you know. Hmm? Sure. Hieronymus. <laughs> what a name. <laughs> yeah. Jim Barlow. Happy to make your acquaintance, Mr. Barlow. Mount Claxton. 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 What are you doing back in this territory? Oh, I got a Brother fine line of enamel wear. Doing pot, side dishes. All right, you can talk now. We're by ourselves. In my business, friend, caution becomes a habit. Oh, Mr. Peterson, Mr. Peterson wants to meet you Saturday night. Well, Sheriff Mosley's office is I'll be there. Hello, Peterson. Glad you could make it. Good to see you, Jim. Sheriff Mosley. Sheriff? Deputy Boston. Howdy. Howdy. I was beginning to worry about you. I did a little worrying myself. How's Monk? Oh, just fine, just fine. Sit down, sit down. Now, gentlemen, here's the layout. I got the clique all primed for a big haul. All that's necessary is to bait the trap, but we must bait it well. Mm, it's a telegram, Indianapolis. James Barlow, Seymour, Indiana. Based on yield this year, the next corn crop should reach 100,000 bushels, and we'll need your help to farm. Aunt Mary leaves here Friday the 11th on train 58 on her way to Louisville. Try to see her for a moment at Seymour's. What does this mean? That's, That's my way of contacting the Home Office, the company. Oh. It means train 58 leaving Indianapolis, Indianapolis for Louisville. Louisville. This, this coming Friday so will be carrying $100,000. $100,000? So that's it. $100,000. It's the answer to everything. It means we can go to California. Now, gentlemen, I, I, I won't be buying my tickets yet. Remember, Friday's only three days off. That won't give me enough time to get my men together. Claxton and I can't handle this by ourselves. You got the Reno boy. I don't get along with a man. They've done good so far. Reputation, yes, but still thought of. This is a big job. It has to be handled right. 
Отдавайте за это. 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 Отдавайте за за that kind of money, we can afford to let you do it. can't be any hit or miss about this. We'll meet at the U-Haul farm at five in the morning. I'll be waiting. I'll be waiting. Hello, man. Barlow, I gotta talk to you. What about? Lori. I want you to get her away from here before it's too late. I tried to get her away myself. I don't know what that might do. You can break her loose. That's what you can do about it. My brothers are no good. They're destroying themselves, they're destroying Laura, and maybe you too if you don't get away. But I, uh, she's saving Mr. Barlow. Believe me, she's saving Mr. Barlow. Take her away. She's in love with you. She's in love with you. Seems to me that this is something we should say for some reason.
Доберись до Клэкстона. Смотри, Зим, я крутой Эли. Ладно, стреляй во всех. Зим, справа. Чего ты не дал пристрелить предателя? Я спас его и тебя. Ладно, забирайте его. Шагай. Большинство уехало на лошадях. Мы соберем их. Он был хорошим человеком, Питерсон. Мы покажем тебе, у кого здесь право. They may, indeed. Nobody knows what the Renos can do. We simply cannot take any more chances with them, not only for our own sakes, 
but for the sake of the whole state. All around us, other counties are decent and God-fearing, while we have been notorious. This is not my idea. This is the idea of the majority of you. None of us is excited. None of us is hot-headed. This is something that has to be done, and done with as little compunction as you would kill a rattlesnake. Anybody got anything to say? As long as the Renos are left alive, there's always the threat that we'll be terrorized again. I say the time has come for us to make sure we can live the rest of our lives in peace and quiet. And to take some of the shame off Jackson County. Anything else? We've got enough. Let's get the job done. It's now 11 o'clock. We'll leave right away. That should put us there by three while it's still dark. Come armed and with masks. Come on. Лора. Это должно было случиться. Либо твои братья, либо я. Извини, но я не мог сказать тебе правду о себе. Oh, Кто здесь? It's all right, Noah. Это ты, Джим? Yeah. Ага. Well, Я услышал какую-то стрельбу. Это ты on? здесь? Oh. Oh. Кто oh. это? Он здесь. Мистер Барлоу. Лора. Они пошли за Фрэнком и другими. Толпа из города. Направились в Вернон. Позаботься о Лоре. Фишер, Дедрик и полоумная старуха взбудоражили весь город.
Don't move. Raise your hands, Sheriff. Stand up. Don't reach for your gun. What do you want? We want the Reno brothers. You can give us brother. the keys. Give us the keys. See me. Listen. You men got no right to us the keys. Hurry up, we haven't got all night. Hurry up, we haven't got all night. Which way? There. All right, take them out. Get your hands off of me. You keep shooting the barrel. We are going to break the law. I'm going in. We're the law. We're the law. We're the citizens. We're going through this. Frank! Get away from those ropes! Too late, Marlowe. You won't know it in order. Is this the way to get it with the mob? The Reno's are going to be tried. Tried, legal, and proper. They're going to be hanged. Get out of here, Marlowe. 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 Get out of here, Mar Who are the others? Dedrick, who was it? I don't play flinches much better than I like Alfred. Put him in the Reno cell. After a few years behind the bars, maybe you'll change your tune. Who's the other one? 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 Мне не следовало приезжать. Я должна была. Извини, Лора, я пытался. Я знаю. 